Good morning, good afternoon or good evening wherever you might be watching. I'd like to explain and demonstrate this time to you how we can consolidate files. Here I see that I have a budget for the UK for the administration budget for the year 2014 with various expenses and uh, totals for each of the quarters, the grand total down the bottom and the same for the USA administration and the same for the Australian administration for the 2014 budgets. I want to be able to consolidate the data in these three files into a summary file. So what I see initially in this particular uh, situation is that the labels are exactly the same in each of the files the same with the quarters across the top of each of the uh, files and the matching labels are here in the summary file. Now uh, this is what we call consolidation by position. So what I want to do of course is to add all the numbers in the UK, Australia and US, USA file and consolidate them over here in the summary file. The first step I take is to click in the first cell in which the data will display in other words quarter one then I go to data consolidate up pops the consolidate window and the function I want to use is the sum function there are other statistical functions there but I want to use the sum function my first step is to click in the reference line then I'll go to the UK summary sheet, uh, budget sheet rather, and click on this cell here, B7, drag across to F7 and then down to F18. I then see there is a reference in this line to the file name, Admin Expenses UK, followed by the name of the worksheet UK, followed by an exclamation mark which separates the cell references uh, from the worksheet name. Then I simply click Add. Now I do the same thing with the USA and I drag across and down to select all of the data and Add. Now I'll do the same thing with the Australian budget figures across and, whoops, and down. Just scroll that up again and I'll add those as well. I'll also put a tick in Create Links to the Source Data. These files have what we call the source data in them so that if any uh, change is made to these figures in the source data then that change will be automatically reflected in the summary file. Now when I click OK there I see, I just have to widen that column a little bit, there I see the totals of uh, uh, each of those three source files here in the summary file. So nothing too difficult about it. Remember data consolidate is the, uh, is the key to the exercise. A um, bit of practice and you'll soon see how it works. The key to this particular uh, exercise working correctly was that the worksheets uh, in the files were laid out in exactly the same way. I'll put a link on this video uh, which you be able to see a video where the labels are different. So this particular method is called consolidate by position where the labels are not the same as you'll see in the next video that's, uh, that's called con uh, consolidate by category. So don't forget to subscribe, bit of practice involved, not difficult and um, uh, if you haven't subscribed we'd love to have you as a subscriber of course and we also happen to like likes and comments. So thank you so much for watching.